Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. It's that time again. We're down here at uh, San Luis Obispo Animal Services with the county's homeless dogs and cats, and we are ready to sell you a new friend. Ah, are you talking about Diesel? Diesel would be the perfect new friend because he's pretty much a perfect dog. I met up with Joan, who takes all the small dogs and kind of gets them used to being at the shelter and such, and she said to me, I got a dog for you. She brings Diesel to me. She said, this is a perfect dog. He loves to do everything, be with people, be on his own. He's a master at agility. Did you know that, Deborah? He is really good at agility. Amazing. Very good. Yes, we're talking about you. And he is lovable. He's extremely lovable, and he's also very good with other dogs. So if you have other dogs at home, that's great. But if you don't, that's okay, too, because he loves people. He's just a nice, easy keeper. Um, you know, a nice medium energy, just a sweetheart. We think about five or six years old and just as nice a dog as you are likely to find anywhere. In fact, he's we're surprised he's here because he's perfect. And he's cute as he can be. And he's got those signature ears that we love. A great little guy. Diesel's ID number is 174312. We love him. This is Kiko and he is a shelter favorite. He's a dog who does not seem to have had a very good life up to now. Um, just probably an outdoor dog. Just came in a little rough shape. Very thin. He is the happiest, friendliest little guy. He's very sweet. Easy going. Um, and doing a lot better now that he's down here getting some good care. We really love this dog. And volunteers say that they want him to be the volunteer pick of the month. One of the two dogs that we pick to be volunteers pick of the month rate very high with the volunteers as kind of the best best dog and we voted kiko volunteer pick this month that means if you love him like we do you adopt him half off your adoption fee you can't beat that deborah you really can't and um, that is a really good deal with all the other things that come with an adoption here the neuter surgery comes with it microchip his first series of shots a one-year rabies um, Braby shot, office visit to a vet. It's a really good deal. And then when half of that is paid, it's an even better deal. And you get this dog. And you get sweet, sweet Kiko, who just really deserves to be somebody's indoor loving companion for the rest of his life. So volunteer pick Kiko's ID number is 147087. Please come and meet this sweet, sweet animal. Well, this is probably the most beautiful dog in the shelter. Everybody thinks Shay is stunning. Um, she's a golden retriever, German shepherd mix. Um, she should be very trainable. With that mix in her, she should be very trainable. And what she needs to be trained to do is like dogs, because that's the only reason she is still here at the shelter. At this point, we haven't had luck pairing her up and liking other dogs. So she either needs to be the only dog in the home or she needs to go with some people willing to really work with her on her doggy socialization. But if you want a stunning creature to get you noticed and to be your companion because she's extremely loving with people, um, then she would be a great dog for you. So the Utterly Beautiful Shays ID number is 203802. This is Mr. Friendly, Mr. Happy, Mr. Wonderful, and his name is Mr. White. Um, just an all-around nice dog. Really sweet. He's r really great to walk. He's easy on the leash. He gets along well with other dogs down here. About three years old, maybe a little bit younger. Just an all-around nice guy. I don't know what else to say about this great little dog. His ID number is 198507. Here's Sally, another shelter favorite. Um, a little chubby, but she's only three years old. She's just a sweet, easygoing, nice dog. Um, she loves people. She's another one that so far, though, has not really loved other dogs. So that's really the only reason she's still here, because a lot of people are really interested in her. But since so far she hasn't shown dog friendliness, she's still here. But again, that's sometimes something that can be worked with. And sometimes there's people out there that just want one loving, loyal companion. And she would be one terrific, loving, loyal companion. Half of her adoption fee has been paid. She is another of the volunteer's picks. And she's a beauty of a Rottweiler. Sally's ID number is 203359. We just love this girl. This sweet old guy is so looking for his retirement home and a lap to retire in. He just wants to be right next to you. He's the friendliest, happiest little guy. He's terrific with um, other dogs, very friendly towards people. Just, he is so nice. And again, he's, 
he's a little bit older, he does qualify for the senior rebate, which means you get a $35 rebate on his adoption fee if you adopt him. Um, you know, again, this is another one that looks like he's in kind of, you know, hasn't had very good care. He's had some skin problems, but I mean, it's nothing that can't clear up very nicely with some good care, some, just some love, good food, um, flea medications, all the kinds of things that tend to lead to skin problems if they're not treated correctly. Just a super nice dog. His name is Buddy. His ID number is 045634. This um, is an absolutely incredibly gorgeous dog. She's about three years old. Her name is Alice. Her owners could no longer keep her. And this is the deal about Alice. Um, and these are, this Larry's worked with her quite a bit. And those of you who've been watching the show a while, you know Larry, you know he knows dogs as well as anybody down here, most other places. Um, at least that's what he tells me. Anyway, uh, Alice is, besides gorgeous, highly intelligent. You can look at her face and tell that. Uh, she's down as a German Shepherd Doberman Pinscher. I suppose that's what she is. She almost looks like a brown Malinois, but she just is that, got that highly intelligent, look about her but she hasn't been trained very well or at all um, she would benefit from some pretty serious training probably professional level um, she at this point is not getting along with other dogs but that could probably be trainable as well but for somebody that is looking for a dog to just really learn a lot of stuff do, she is a very highly trainable highly intelligent dog and she is absolutely beautiful as well um, Alice's ID number is 947696. You know, she's really for experienced dog owners only, but in the right owner's hands, this dog could be brilliant and an absolutely amazing companion. Probably could be a good search and rescue animal, actually. I mean, I think she's really that smart. But at any rate, this is Alice. Um, and her number, 947696. Well, I got to tell you, I love this guy. Um, he came into the shelter on the 12th of March from Templeton, um, picked up as a stray. He is a really loving, sweet dog. This guy will just lay by you. He wants you to pet him. He wants you to just, he is just looking to be someone's best buddy. Um, I, I just love dogs like this. I don't, I wish they got better care. Um, his ID number is 204439. His name is going to be Maximus if nobody uh, comes and redeems him. And he is just a lover and a half. I don't know what else to tell you. He is just terrific in so the love department. So he needs a second chance, Deborah. That's he just needs, all there is to it. He needs a second chance. He needs, I mean, I'm hoping, you know, of course his owners come up or come show up for him. But if they don't, then he needs, I can't tell you what great companions these dogs are. I just adore him. And he's just a wonderful guy. His ID number is 204 439 and came in on the 12th, and are you missing your very nice dog? He's down here. Well, it's a, the understatement of the century to say that Scooby does not like the shelter. He does not like the shelter. He is absolutely crazy about Larry, and once he gets to know you, he loves you. But new people scare him. This place scared him. He's only a year and four months old. I mean, he's a very young dog, but he just kind of freaked out at the shelter. Um, but he's coming around, and obviously, right now, Larry's just the greatest thing since toast, according to Scooby. <laughs> um, just a terrific little guy, cute as can be, needs, needs somebody to adopt him who's going to be a little bit patient, you know, until he feels comfortable. And I have a feeling outside of this setting, he would be a lot warmer, a lot faster. He likes women better. He likes women better than men, apparently. Um, although obviously you can come around with men too because there he is loving Larry. His ID <laughs> now, God, Larry, we're not going to be able to get Larry out of the shelter through the door. We're, we're done with the show today. Uh, Scooby's ID number is 204304. Cute as can be, needs a patient adopter, and they will have a fabulous companion. Greer thinks Duncan won the big head of the week award. <laughs> he might. He's, that's a, that is a salami head. It is indeed. This is Duncan. He's a really nice dog. He was really timid when he came in, but he's warmed up considerably. He uh, is, <laughs> he's a funny dog. He's loving and affectionate. Um, he likes, uh, in particular, other female dogs. He, um, you know, has made friends with some of the girl dogs down here. He likes to play. 
He's well loved by the volunteers and just an all around. He knows sit down and shake. Now, come on. There mm -hmm. you're ahead of the game right there. Excellent. Um, and we have some volunteers. I would not be one, but we have some volunteers down here that, that like to jog with the dogs. And he, they say he is a good jogging partner. So although he looks a little, I don't know, what would you call it? Lunky, maybe? Chunky. Yeah, definitely. Chunky, lunky, mm -hmm. all those kinds of things. He's actually quite a pretty good athlete. So Duncan, about two years old and as cute as can be. And um, if you had a female dog at home that's very playful, he would do really well with that, too. And since we're talking about, you, he had several girlfriends down here. And for those of you who've been watching the show for a while, uh, three of our longest residing dogs were adopted recently. So anyone worrying about Tinkerbell or Marilyn or Val, don't worry. All three of those beautiful girls got adopted. They looked similar to this guy. Yay, hooray for those a three. A couple of them were here for seven months. Wow. That's quite a long time. But... You know, it takes a community, it takes a village, it takes open hearts, it takes, you know, people using social media, print media, television, volunteers down here working with the dogs, keeping them happy, keeping them adoptable. It takes caring staff and just cooperation and you get wonderful, miraculous adoptions, which is what we want for Duncan. ID number 204096. Deborah, I have to say, I just love her markings, that half and half face, you know, that black around that one eye, that white is so on the classic. other. That really is so classic. attractive. She is. This is lovely Lucy. Um, she is a really nice dog, a very good ball dog. She loves to play with toys. She's a very, very playful dog. Um, she also ignored the office cat when we gave her that test, so that's good. Uh, she seems to be house trained. She just seems like an all around nice dog. Her ID number is 203298, pretty little medium-sized Lucy. I have all wonderful things to say about this little girl. She is just about two years old. She is the happiest, the friendliest, the most well-socialized, funny little girl you could imagine. Cute as uh, a button, by the way. She, isn't she cute? <laughs> she came into the shelter on the 14th and from um, Aurora Grande. So on March 14th, this little girl got picked up in Arroyo Grande by our officers. She is adorable. I, I can't imagine nobody's down here looking for this dog. She is so incredibly sweet. Uh, her ID number is 204479. And if nobody comes and claims this girl, we're going to call her Amanda. But seriously, great little dog would be great for a family. Well, everyone, every shelter needs a horse, and here's our, here's our, our faux horse. This is Atticus. He's the big boy in the shelter right now. Um, everybody loves this dog. He's surprisingly easy on leash. He's a big-time ball dog. Uh, he just he catches the ball. He'll catch it in the air. He'll run after it. He loves to play with toys. He is very strong, and he is quite large. Um, he likes mostly female dogs. I, there are a few males he's okay with, but definitely he has a preference for females. He is a gorgeous dog, whatever he is. We think German Shepherd and Rottweiler, but we're not sure. He was a stray. So our big boy here's ID number is 203869. He's just looking for his family. Boo-Boo's a sweetheart. Um, this little girl was, was turned in. Um, her family couldn't keep her anymore. Uh, and she, she's kind of skittish with men. She's pretty comfortable with Larry because he's here so often. She does, though, seem to have a preference for women. M men just seem to scare her a little bit. Um, when she first came in here, she was terrified. We could barely get her off her bed. She didn't want to go for walks. Now she's gotten to the point where she enjoys her walks. She's fine out in the yards with the other dogs. You know, she doesn't in interact with them a lot, but she'll hang out with the other little dogs, and she's fine with that. She's come a long, long way from when we first saw her. She has. Yeah. I was really worried when she came in that we weren't going to be able to get her warmed up enough to be adoptable, but she, she is now. It's, it's amazing to me the change in her. See, she, Deborah, the volunteers can do wonders with these animals. It's amazing. It, it is absolutely amazing. So many of these dogs would be probably put down if they didn't have people down here every day working with them. And we can always use more volunteers. We always can. Can't have enough volunteers. We need dog walkers. We need cat groomers and, and just people to pay attention to them. Dogs can be in a shelter a long time, Terry, if they're getting attention. Yes, they and, can. They do better with that attention and they get adopted faster anyway. The ones really that need do. attention like Boo Boo here. 
it's really important. So if you have some time on your hands, come volunteer with us. Half of Boo Boo's adoption fee has been paid because the volunteers love her so much. She's about four years old and probably would do best in a quiet home, you know, without a whole lot of stuff going on because she, she is a little bit skittish. But a quiet home would be great. She'd be a wonderful friend to somebody or a family. Her ID number is 203-789. This is Boo Boo. Here we have a lovely orange cat. It's Pumpkin. Pumpkin is a senior. She's just about eight years old. So Pumpkin qualifies for our senior rebate. Yes, we want to get our seniors out of here ASAP. So we give you $35 back on your adoption fee if you choose one of our seniors. And seniors are so great. They already know how to behave. So you've got a bargain here with Pumpkin and all the seniors that we have here. Consider Pumpkin, ID number 204372. She is a great cat. What a great looking cat we've got here. This is Sneakers. He is a long-haired cat and very nicely marked. Very interesting. This cat will get you noticed. This cat is about five years old. His ID number is 204155. We're calling him Sneakers. I wonder why. Look at those paws. 204155 Sneakers. Next up, I have the pleasure to introduce you to Larry. Larry is a wonderful tabby cat. He is so well mannered and so great, he can fit into any situation. Larry just so happens to be our volunteer's pick of the month. Yes, sir. Larry's uh, adoption fee is half paid for you. So if you fall in love with him, you only have to pay half of his adoption fee. ID number 195088. Volunteers really, really love this cat, and that's why he got to be Volunteer's Pick of the Month. Larry, 195088. Just look at this cutie pie. This is Oreo, and she is just about three years old. She is ID number 204373. Oreo is a great cat, long-haired, black and white, very attractive, Great personality. ID number 204373, Oreo. Volunteers can't say enough about this cat. He is so great. He fits into any situation. He's affectionate. He's loving. He loves to be on your lap. He loves to snooze on your lap. Can't get enough of petting. Friendly, friendly guy. This is Bart. Bart is ID number 204317, and we're going to also give Bark the title of Volunteer's Pick of the Month. Yes, we can pick two, and Bart is our second one. That means half of his adoption fee is already paid. So come down here, meet Bart, fall in love with him, I guarantee you will, and out you go, half adoption fee paid. ID number 204317, Bart. Now, Chrissy here, she is the Mae West of all of our cats. She is a big bone girl, and she's proud of it. She is a little bit older. She is nine years old. That makes her a senior, which means she qualifies for the senior rebate. That's right, $35 back on Chrissy if you adopt her. Volunteers love her. She likes to be groomed. She'll be a very happy cat if you take her out of here. Uh, ID number 204423, that's Chrissy. Now here's a very young cat. This is Georgia, and Georgia is just seven months old. Look at those gorgeous topaz eyes, yummy. Georgia is a black cat, as you can see, so she qualifies for the black cat rebate. $25 back in your pocket if you adopt Georgia. Georgia's ID, 204020, Georgia. Well, you're looking at a white dominant flame point. Yes, if you can see her markings on her face, you'll see that she truly is a Siamese. Gorgeous blue eyes, lovely tail, wonderful fur. This is Annie, and she's just a love bug. Yes, she is. And Annie is just 10 months old, if you can believe that, and she's at Animal Services. Annie's going to go fast, so if you have any interest after you see her here, run down here and adopt her. Her ID number is 200021. Annie, Flame Point Siamese. Here is a wonderful black cat. Yes, you're right. Petal does qualify for the black cat rebate. She is all black and she's got the prettiest topaz eyes. She is just about two years old and her ID number is 204447. Petal.
Well, we've got these wonderful Maine Coon type cats for you coming up. You're going to love them. Here is Fluffy. And Fluffy is just about 10 years old. That qualifies for the senior rebate. Yes, she does. ID number 204204. And if you adopt Fluffy, you get $35 back for the fact that she is a senior. We really want to get these senior cats out of here. This is no place for any senior to wind up. They need a nice window. They need a patch of sunshine. And they'll be happy as they can be. Consider Fluffy, ID number 204204. Say hi to Jake. He is a nice, big, handsome tabby. So well adjusted, he's cool and collected. Jake can fit into any situation. ID number 204203. That's Jake. You're looking at Mr. Gray. He's a no nonsense type of cat. He is very confident. He's just about five years old, and his ID number is 204486, Mr. Gray. Here is a beautiful cat. You've got to come down here and see the coloring on this cat. She is a dilute tortoiseshell, I'd say, though she's got some white on her, so she could be a calico tabby, tortoiseshell, whatever, but she is beautiful. She has those great round eyes I love. She's a real looker. She's just about three years old, and we're naming her Portia because she can carry a name like that. Her ID number is 204473. Come on down and meet Portia. Get her out of this cage. And by the way, if you have any time, you can come down here and volunteer with us. If you like cats, you can take a cat out of the cage. They live in these very small spaces. All they do all day long is just sleep. You could take them out of the cage, groom them, talk to them. It makes them more adoptable and sociable. And it really makes their day go faster. So if you have any time on your hands and you want to volunteer, please call the volunteer line, 781-4413. Leave your name, say you want to volunteer, and we'll call you back and tell you how to do it. The cats would really appreciate it. But for now, consider adopting Portia, ID number 204473. Here's another swell cat you really want to meet. This is Oscar, and he's a playboy. Yes, he is. He's just about five years old. As you can see, he's long-haired. He needs some grooming, that's for sure. But, come on, that's an excellent thing to be doing with you and your cat. That's how you bond. Oscar would so like to get out of here and get groomed, for sure. So, consider Oscar, ID number 204386. Come on down, meet Oscar or any of our lovely cats down here. Here's another nice big tabby boy. He's got a blaze of white on his nose, so we're calling him Blaze. He's just about five years old, great temperament, and his ID number is 204467. Blaze. Next up, we have Gypsy. Gypsy is a boy, so we're going to call him Gypsy Boy. He's five years old, and his ID number is 204357. Gypsy Boy. Can you see the markings on this cat? She is gorgeous. She was just making biscuits, which means she's very, very friendly. She came right up to the front of the cage. She is Gina. She has a great look about herself. Her ID number, 204466. That's Gina. Well, Nero here is kind of excitable. Cats do get excitable in these cages when you go um, into them because they have to defend their space. So if you see him hissing at all, that's why he's doing that. Nero is a really nicely marked black and white. And look at his nose. He's got a little heart-shaped nose. That's adorable. He is just about five years old, and his ID number is 204320. Nero. Seems black and white is the color of the day. Here's Caesar. You just met Nero, and here is his brother Caesar. He is five years old, and his ID number is 204319. So if you want two cats that go together, Caesar and Nero would be those two. They came from the same home. So if you like double seeing black and whites, Caesar and Nero would be great companions. Caesar's number 204319. Here's a cutie pie. This is Cherish. She is just about a year old. Very cute, very petite, very scared here. 
Her ID number is 204449. And Cherish would be a cat that would be ideal for a volunteer to take under their wing, so to speak. If you come down here and volunteer, you could take Cherish out of her cage. And I would guess two sessions worth of petting and holding would turn this cat around. She is really shy right now, but I think if a volunteer gets this cat out of the cage, grooms, pets, talks to it, Cherish will come right around. So if you have nothing to do and time on your hands, come and volunteer with some of our cats or some of our dogs. ID number 204449, Cherish. Say hi to Dennis. He is another big tabby cat. He's just about two years old, and his ID number is 204469, Dennis. Say hi to Ziggy. Ziggy's right here coming out to meet and greet. He's a very, very friendly cat. He's just about two years old, and as you can see, he is black. Yes, that's right. So Ziggy qualifies for the black cat rebate. Ziggy's got those great green eyes that we love, so when he looks at you, he just looks at you with all of that love. His ID number is 204395. That is Ziggy. Here's another big, beautiful black and white cat. This cat is Panda. Panda is female, just about five years old. Panda's ID number 204428, and Panda is fearless and very affectionate, so she can fit into any situation right away. ID number 204428, Panda. Well, here's a new color combo. We've got an orange and white. This is Charm. Charm is just about a year and a half old. She is female and she is a doll. ID number 204362, Charm. Well, here is Shay, and she is looking coyly over her shoulder at you. She is a great cat. Shay is a senior, so she qualifies for a senior rebate. $35 back on Shay if you come down and adopt her. She is ID number 204480, Shay. And here's another great looking cat. We've seen so many great looking cats today, all different, and a lot of long haired cats, which means we really need you to come down here and volunteer to get a comb into some of this fur. Penny's looking pretty darn good today. Penny is also a senior. She is eight years old, so she qualifies for the senior rebate. So that's good for you. If you adopt her, you get $35 back. Her ID number is 204481, and she is the sweetest, sweetest cat. That's Penny, 204481.